Hey guys, how's it going? Tia's back again with episode number 16 of the My Player series here on Xbox One. And as you can see on the right hand side, we are in excellent form. 25 games played, 13 goals, 6 assists. And if you look in the bottom left, actually I'll bring it up onto screen so we can read the news story. The manager believes that we are unbeatable. Sheffield United's Chesnoid received an endorsement from his manager today after providing some great performances in recent matches. I set some targets for him and he went on doing everything I asked of him. His play recently is key to our squad and I'm very happy with what's been accomplished recently stated the Sheffield United manager so I'm pleased he's pleased everybody's pleased we're doing well on our league objectives we're doing well in the league let's have a quick look at the tables you can see we're fifth in those uh, playoff spots actually with a game in hand and can go second if we win that game in hand by uh, a decent margin but we actually have the team that's in second in our next game against Coventry and I'll actually have a quick look at the calendar we won't make it into the January transfer window today we'll have oh, Wolves again so we got first and second in today's episode wow two massive games then on uh, Saturday we'll have uh, Gillingham and uh, was that Tranmere? Yes, Gillingham and Tranmere will be into the January transfer window. But let's jump into the game against Coventry then. See if we can pick up a win and move ourselves up into second in the table. That's going to be crucial. And uh, we'll have to wait and see how everyone else does ahead of us. Actually, look at that. Look, we've finished the bulk of four fixtures for uh, our upcoming targets. We've matched the uh, the average match rating. 7.2 they wanted, 7.3 we got. They wanted one goal, we got two. And they wanted a 20% goal conversion rate. And we've managed to get a 25. So very pleased with how we're developing now as a pro. I actually don't think I'm going to use use any boosts from here on out I only used the one and to be completely honest we've been doing fantastically well we we're up to a 73 overall already so I'm not going to use any more boosts we're just going to grow as is because uh, we should be able to get a decent move in the summer maybe we'll get a move in the January transfer window who knows let's jump into the next game then shall we with against Coventry Coventry rules Tranmere Gillingham today and Saturday's episodes are part of the uh, the upcoming targets they want 6.0 rating out of us in the league it's achievable they want one goal and a goal conversion rate of 14% all of that is definitely Definitely, definitely achievable. So let's jump into the game against Coventry and pick up three points. Coventry on the attack here. Well cut up on Maguire, but he's lost it. It's through to Baker. He's got the chance to put Coventry 1-0 up and takes it. The 13th mini is unlucky for us. Oh, the 13th minute, eh? 1-0 down, unfortunately. Not too sure what Baker that is. It's not Nathan Baker, because he's at Villa, isn't he? I think Nathan Baker's the one at Villa. Anyway... Uh, let me know in the comment section down below if you know which Baker that is, but regardless of which Baker it is, we are 1-0 down in the minute of the Baker's dozen. So maybe it was uh, Carl Baker, there you go. Maybe it was uh, it was meant to be that Carl Baker scored in the minute of the Baker's dozen. I know it's a really bad pun, but I'm going to run with it. Apparently I've just picked up a booking for something that happened ages ago. That was... That was just me tugging on his shirt. That was literally 10 minutes ago in game. My guy looks like an absolute retard there, doesn't he? But uh, that's our first booking of our career. I'm rather annoyed about that because that was just a nothing challenge. Really want to get us back in this game now because the rest pissed me off. It's a nice ball to Brayford down the outside. Get the ball into Painter. I'm going to get the ball. I'm going to turn. I'm going to break past. I'm going to shoot and we're going to score. And it's back to 1 1. 33 minutes in. That was nice. That was a really nice move. I am pleased with that. I am very pleased with that. And you can probably tell by the intensity of my voice right now. I'm not too joyous. I'm more just determined than anything else. That was a really nice move. Great touch, great turn, great acceleration. Fantastic finish. We're back on 1-1. Let's get another one and get ourselves in front. Oh, that's nice. Play out wide. Keep possession, actually, there, because I had a couple of players on me. Oh, he's found me. I'm going to drill it back across. Finish. Oh, he's 2-1. Yes! slide in that is fantastic my voice almost gave out on me there yeah 2-1 up from 1-0 down oh nutmegs on the defender as well great determination is probably the word of the episode great determination to get to the ball on the byline fantastic cutback fantastic header oh we're two in front against coventry i'm gonna call for it in here oh he's decided to whip it instead we could go up there can i bring this down i can We've got a bit of space. We have. We've got a good shot. We most certainly do. I'm going to do a cheeky whoop. Brick drop. I couldn't quite time it to trip over the ball. But we go 3-1 up. Two goals and an assist so far in this one. This is a big, big performance from us right now. Exactly what we needed against a team that are above us in the league. I can't believe we're 3-1 up, honestly. We've been so good since they went 1-0 in front. Into Jibangu. I'm going to look for the return ball if I can. And he's there. 
He's got a man over. We could whip this in. We can make it four and put the game to bed. Billy Payne's on the head up. Keeps has got to do better, but we do not care. We do not care one tiny little bit. It's Sheffield United four, Coventry City one. Now these guys have been absolutely dominating the league, so this is an absolute turn up for the books, this result. Really pleased with Billy Payne to be able to pick up a goal as well. And he's, the manager's taking him off as well. Well played, Billy. Very, very well played. Dave's on the outside. It's a lovely ball through to Adams, who's injured and makes it five. Oh, I have no words. No words whatsoever for the situation we find ourselves in now. This is one of those one-off performances to just come out of the blue. Completely unexpected. Coventry have not exactly been off their game. They've been very, very good. We just apparently have been extremely clinical in front of goal. Sheffield United 5, Coventry City 1. And there goes the final whistle. I don't know. I don't know. Don't ask me. I don't know how we've managed to come our way with a 5-1 win here against second to the second in the table. But uh, we'll take it. We most definitely will take it. Two goals, one assist, a 9.7 rating. Getting loads of traits as well. Outside shot, outside the foot shot trait penalties have gone up too. I will actually check my traits now then. Oh, jeeps, we're getting so many. Five man in the matches. That was our fifth man in the match apparently. Attack position and up too. I'll check the traits, see if we've got anything we can add on. We have got traits we can add on. We've got long throw in. I mean, you can have five on at one time, can't you? So we'll have early crosser, second wind, early uh, outside the foot shot, we've got skill dribbling as well. That's five. They're the only ones we've got. So we put uh, we put five traits on. Hopefully that'll help us improve even more. And as you can see on your screen, we've actually gone up to 74 overall now. We're playing just phenomenally right now. This is so so good. Let's jump into that Wolves game and see if we can pick up a win against top of the league. We could have a chance here. They've given the ball away. Oh, it's a lovely, lovely little through ball. Could be in. We'll try a step over cut inside. Man's coming, take it early. He's taking a flex and it's going to go into the back of the net. So, so lucky. So very, very lucky. But we'll take it. I think the goal is going to go down to us as well by the looks of things rather than an own goal. I'm not sure whether that shot by me was actually on target. It might have gone, or in real life, it might have gone down to the dubious goals panel. Have a look at a couple of the replays. Because, of course, in real life, if the initial shot is off target, then it goes down as, the, as an own goal. If we get a decent, this should be a decent angle. Is this shot going in? That shot, I, I just can't tell. It might have been sneaking in the back post. It looked like it was going wide. As from uh, Oh, this should be a good angle as well. Actually, that might have been going in. It came off his arm as well. So regardless of the uh, the goal, we could have had a penalty even if it hadn't gone in. But nonetheless, 1-0 up, away at top of the league. Absolutely fantastic stuff. He's going to find us, though. Can we get a turn on the defender? We can. It drops to Chibangu, takes the ball away from us. Probably... In fairness, that's the right thing to do in that situation. I wasn't really going anywhere. Can we up a cross in? We can. We can't. We can. We can't. We can? Question mark. Come on, Brayford. Keep it in. He's done well. He's whipped in across. Can I beat the goalkeeper too? I can. We've headed it. It's into the back of the net. Is it given a goal? It has given the goal. We're going to take it. It's our fourth goal of this episode. What is going on? What is going on? We are at the very top of our form right now. Initially, I thought the referee had given a free kick against the goalkeeper. See if we can skip to a replay. Braveford did very well to uh, to really dig out across there. And I think we've just beaten the goalkeeper to it. Let's see a slow-mo replay. Slow it down. Yeah, we've just beaten him to it. He's gone to punch it and missed it. We've risen with the header. It's only our second or third headed goal. Delighted! Sheffield United 2, <laughs> Wolverhampton Wanderers nil. Can we do anything from this free kick? Hopefully he whips it in looking for us. He has done, can we get there? I've got there first, oh! So close to a hat-trick. Oh, he's given a free kick, fine. We weren't so close to a hat-trick. And they could be in straight away, Edwards breaking free. He's got a man running off him, Jamie O'Hara gets the rebound, unfortunately. And they've got a man over again. Who's this? It's Henry whipping the ball in. It's Dicko on the ball. And away we go. So we're going in at half-time with a 2-0 lead. And again, I have to say, it's a shock 2-0 lead. I didn't expect us to get a massive win against Coventry. I was hoping for a point. And away at Wolves, after the way they performed in the home game against us, I just... For us to be 2-0 up with two goals from ourselves is... Well... It's delightful, to be completely honest. I don't really know any other way to explain it. We'll try and get ourselves a hat-trick if you possibly can in the second half. That definitely hit an arm, didn't it, from the uh, defender there. But nonetheless, into the back of the net. 2-0 up. Second half, here we go. Great challenge from Chibangu. What a ref. Have a word. That was such a good challenge. How is that a foul? 
I don't understand. The ref's done us here. They've got a real chance to get a goal back. I think they've made a substitution and the game's bugging out on me. They should come back in a minute. Has They brought on Leon Clark for Dicko. It's a good free kick. Good save by Dominguez. And we will hack that clear. Get out. You can find me again. He has done. Now do I cut inside? I have done. Chance for the hat-trick. Oh my god. Oh my god. We've picked up our first hat-trick. Five goals in this episode. A hat-trick away from home against top of the league. You, you just can't get better. You cannot get better than that in the situation we're in in our careers right now. We are most definitely in the form of our lives. Right before the January transfer window as well. I really didn't expect that turn inside to come off so well, but it did. We've made a change, brought a McGinn for Scalgill, but we're 3-0 up. We could get a decent... I, actually, I don't know. Considering we're on a loan spell, can anyone come in for us in the January transfer window, or are we going to have to wait until the end of the season to get a move away from Sheffield United and maybe even you know, pick up a move to a, a bottom half of the Premier League side or top half of the Championship side? as a genuine transfer transfer as opposed to just going back out on loan. Let me know in the comment section down below because I'm not sure how it works in player career mode as opposed to uh, to manager mode. So uh, let me know. But maybe, maybe we can have a big move on the horizon some point soon. Oh, what a ball to find us. I'm going to have to whack that. I'm sorry. I couldn't help myself. It's set up perfectly for a strike. Unfortunately, it was straight at the goalkeeper. We could get another chance. Maybe we can pick up an assist this time. If Porter makes me a nice run and we can find him. Oh, he's so close to doing it. We picked up a free kick, though. Not really too sure what for. Someone foul me. Yes, Jamie O'Hara, apparently. Just lent on me. I'm not too sure that's a foul ref, but we'll take it. I'm on the free kick. Are you serious? I've got 58 free kick accuracy. Well, here goes nothing. Bosh! Off the wall. Lol. Shoot! Shoot, bruv! Oh, we've hit the post! I don't believe it. The final whistle is gone. It's finished 3-0. We've had such a big influence in both games today. Although, to be fair, we only picked up two in the 5-0 or 5-1 win over Coventry. So the team is in mo the most amazing of form right now. We most definitely are in the form of our lives right now. If this isn't the best episode of the series to date, I don't know what is. Honestly, we've been so good. So, so very good. Our finishing has gone up one for our debut hat-trick. Fantastic. 50 shots. 50 shots, 50 chances created, so short passing's gone up one, same for attack positioning. We're only 74 over 8 still, we've got a message, oh it's Chibangu's injured again. He's only out for 5 days, that's fine, because we've got another game coming up against Trammy in the not too distant future. Let's have a look, 2 days time, wow, we might be a little bit tired, but it's into the transfer window. We've got a busy January if we stay at Sheffield United, if we're allowed to stay at Sheffield United. Or if we're not allowed to move, that is. I don't know what's going to happen. But let's have a quick look at the league. It's very, very tight. But we still do have that game in hand. So if we can win that game in hand, we will be on course for automatic promotion. There's still a long way to go. Still a long way to go. But we are absolutely Luis suarez it right now. Just scoring goals left, right and centre. So if you could leave the video a like, guys, that would be absolutely superb. I think this video deserves 100 likes. If you could get it, that would be absolutely wonderful. We are doing so well. So I just, I, there aren't enough superlatives for the way we're playing right now. Four assists of the five they want from us. We only need one more. We only need three more goals before the end of the season. We're definitely going to meet all of our objectives, apart from maybe the match rating. But if we keep playing the way we are, that average rating is going to go up as well. I'm rambling. Let's finish the video here, shall we? That's the end of this. Not, I almost said that's the end of the series. It's definitely not the end of the series. That's the end of the episode, guys. There was an AC Milan career mode video uploaded early on today. So feel free to check the channel page for that. If you missed the earlier video or the previous video in this series, which will have been on Tuesday night, then there's an annotation in the bottom left-hand side of your screen. Or, of course, feel free to check the channel page to do so. And if you aren't subscribed to the channel already, then uh, there's a link in the top right hand side of your screen as an annotation and of course the usual subscribe button down below and a link in the annotation link in the annotation a link in the description as well along with a link to my twitter which is at chesnoy gaming but that's all for today guys thank you very much for watching i can't believe the form we're in right now and i will see you next time